Hi, I'm Brett Smith. I'm a director of TG Metals Limited. Yes, it is pretty exciting. We've just listed on the ASX after a successful IPO process. About 57 million shares on issue and $6 million in cash in the bank. Backed by a really strong and supportive board, Richard Bevan as chairman, Gloria Zhang and myself as non-exec directors, and we've managed to snag a, a really good chief executive officer, David Self. The company's focused on our Lake Johnson project, 50 plus kilometres of the Greenstone Belt, south of the Maggie Hayes and Emily Ann Nickel operations. Our exploration focus is nickel, lithium, and then gold. It's not often you get a project this size, so close to Perth, with exceptional prospectivity for nickel and lithium. Hi, I'm David Self, as geologist and CEO of TG Metals. My background is in um, nickel exploration and development, and also in gold, lithium, and various other commodities such as manganese, iron ore and so forth. I came across the TG Metals um, having known about the project previously when the Maggie Hayes mine was mined by Lion Ore and also by uh, Norilsk in the past. This is uh, an exciting prospect, a great capture of Greenstone Belt all the way through the southern end of Lake Johnson. So what we're going to do different to what has been done in the past is that um, in previously there's been over 6,000 uh, drill holes have been put in this area. However, most of those have been shallow rab drilling we want to test deeper. We also want to use higher powered geophysics than what we've used in the past. Previously, the geophysics only penetrated to less than 150 metres below surface. Most of the nickel sulphide occurrences are occurring in the area are greater than 200. So we need to go and see deeper and put more power in the ground. We've got exploration programs uh, planned and ready to go. And we're looking forward to keeping our shareholders up to date as we progress those through in the next few months.